Fight Live returns to Channel 5 this Friday. Two of Britain's most exciting super lightweights collide at London's legendary York Hall. Don't miss Eubank vs Farrell this Friday on Channel 5. I'm going to share something with you. That might put me in a very negative light, yeah. Relationships are not my forte. You see if someone grabbed up my wife for saying completely different ball game. I'll walk away from here and this has been like a therapy session. Yes. Razaban IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Probably more happy today than I when we interviewed the other day. Um, Sam, congrat congratulations uh, on the win. Talk to me about the performance. Thank you, mate. Um, yeah, I'm happy. That was the game plan. Box, don't fight. He's been drilling it into me, Rod, for about 10 weeks now. Every time I say that I'm fighting on the 27th, he goes, no, you're boxing on the 27th. But he's been drilling it into me non-stop. So, Every, like, you can hear him in the corner shouting, I've got to stay disciplined in there. A couple of times nearly got roped in, but I didn't. I stayed disciplined. And, um, and yeah, we move on. There were times it looked like, like you just said there, that he wanted to come in and say, look, let's just fight. Let's forget boxing. Let's just fight. But like you said, there, you, you remain kind of cool and composed and realise, look, this is, this is a few more rounds still to go. Sometimes you've got to hit and not get hit. Like, that's the name of the game. And that's the game plan we chose today. Listen, we can adapt and we can choose three or four different game plans, but um, yeah, that was the best. That was the best way to get through today. Like unscathed, no marks. We've got a sore hand, but we'll deal with that. <laughs> a bit of rest over Christmas, I'm sure you'll be fine. But was Sean as tough as you expected? Yeah, oh, mate. Listen, I've sparred him, and they, and the spars pretty much went the same as what that fight went like. Um, he's tough. Moves a lot. I mean, I've got a bad blister on my foot where he moves so much. <laughs> I was like that the whole time. Uh, but um, but no, fair play to Sean, mate. He stuck in there the whole time. I hurt him to the body a good few times as well. I mean, how he got up in that right hand, I don't know. Because I was hitting him on afterwards. I just hit him anywhere on the head that I could. And I was catching him on top of the head. And he just wouldn't go nowhere. So, listen, fair play to him. What was it like out there? It's a bit different setting, afternoon as well, so you kind of get up in the morning, refuel yourself, how was it? Mate, I loved it, loved it. I mean, the Sunday thing could catch on. That was blinding. I mean, it helps that I won, but like, that was unreal. I, um, the setup's fantastic, Boxstar, Sky Sports, thank you very much, Ben Shalom, thank you very much for having me. Um, amazing, amazing platform, amazing show, and I'm glad that I could get a win and put myself out there on that channel. Greg Mario speaking to him yesterday, obviously you worked with him, and he's worked with some great fighters over the years as well and, and I know how Greg works because I've worked with Greg as well yeah, yeah, yeah. but how was that how was the experience of having someone with so much knowledge being so he's able to get you in, in in the right physical shape listen Greg's been with me from my debut and uh he used to get me to work away he now now gets me down to this way but he fuels me and gets me in the best shape possible he's um Mate, he's, he's a vital part of the team and I thank him. I mean, he's not managed to get here today, but we missed him and he's been a, he helps so much, mate. He's a, he's brilliant, Greg. Question now is, uh, I know you want to rest, recover, spend time with the, with the family, but what's next? What do you want next? Well, listen, hopefully stay with Sky, stay with Boxer. Um, hopefully get on this platform again, whether it's for the British title, like, I'm sure they're going to have a little plan for me, Rod, like, they're gonna have, they can have a chat and, um, Listen, I'm just happy that I've got the win tonight. I can go and have a, I can go and have my Christmas dinner now and uh, eat a few cakes. But um, just don't go over too 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 much. No, right? no, no. Greg won't let me do that. But um, but no. Listen, we we'll just see what a new year brings. Sean, many congratulations once again, my man. And listen, if I don't speak to you, have a great. I know we're a few weeks away from the festive season, but yeah, enjoy yourself. I'm sure we'll catch up with the new year. Festive season starts now. <laughs> <laughs>